This is a baking tray made of steel and this is a television mount also made of steel. Both of them nearly weigh the same and yet when I place them in water, one of them floats and the other one sinks. Why is that? This is where Archimedes principle comes in. It states that any object fully or partially immersed in a stationary fluid is buoyed up by a force equal to the weight of the fluid displaced by the object. Now let's take a look at a different scenario. Take a plastic bottle and close the cap tightly. If I place it in water, it will float. Now if I take the bottle and fill it up partially and place it back in the water, then the bottle will be partially submerged. Now if I completely fill up the bottle and place it back in, then it sinks. This is the basic principle used by submarines. Submarines have water holding tanks called external ballast tanks surrounding the hull in a concentric manner. These tanks have valves called Kingston valves at the bottom and air vents at the top. These are used to regulate the flow of water in and out of the ballasts. When there is no water in the ballast, the submarine acts like an empty bottle and floats on the surface of the water. When the submarine wants to dive, the air vents and the Kingston valves are opened up. This allows water to fill up the ballasts, displacing the air. When the ballasts are filled with water, the vessel is submerged completely. When the submarine has to resurface, the Kingston valve is opened up and compressed air is pumped into the ballasts, pushing the water out.